Hi, I'm Michael Sherrill. Uh, I want to take a moment to talk about the drawing ribs. Uh, a lot of questions about how they can be used and why they are what they are. Um, for many years, I used a little organic, in fact, this is the ex almost exact tool that I've used for years uh, to draw in clay and draw in porcelain. Um, it's, it's sort of almost like uh, using a paintbrush because it has that nice a leaf shape at the end so when you when you draw into wet clay when you're on the potter's wheel especially it leaves a beautiful serify line and then there's a plain side that also leaves you a bigger bolder mark uh, for instance using on t-bowls so this is a wonderful this is an organic edge one and um, and so we've created one of the things in scrapers for instance when you're working in leather hard clay say you're doing a big platter and you want a texture on the inside. The ones, the scrapers that you get now, and even the ones that we create have a mechanical edge that are very precise. And, and that doesn't always suit everyone's work. I, and my feeling is to, when, when I started investigating and creating these edges, and for years I've had this wallet full of uh, hand carved stainless steel that suited my needs and I've, I've tried to bring some of that out in these tools but if I were trying to put an organic surface on something like scratches or f marks then something like this allows you to to go at it with a, a variable edge and as you scrape and clean across your work especially like in a low bowl shape or platter shape and something of this nature gives you the similar pattern but in a, in a sort of an arc so you can go around things and scrape and sort of hatch mark. And it's just gonna give anyone who works uh, scraping their clay more of an option than just a mechanical edge. And not only that, you can take a file to these and change them if you want. Uh, they're fileable, you can use a, a, dre a Dremel with a small diamond burr on it to change the way, uh, to make your own marks on these ribs. And they're all made of, of high, high quality stainless steel that's uh, high carbon, so it's like the colorly grade that you use in knives, in kitchen knives, it's high end kitchen knives. So really a lot of strength, uh, uh, it's just like our other ribs, but this gives you an edge to, to, to create, almost paint with. And the other application is to use it just in slip. So being able to draw into a very thick slip that you've coated a pot in uh, would be another beautiful way to think about these as, as a different style or a different kind of quality, almost paintbrush uh, across the spectrum.